Okay, everybody. Thankfully, uh, I guess the last save point was inside this room. So we're good. We're not too far behind, and we're good to give it a go. Another college try, so to speak. Um... Wait, 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 hold on. Holy shit, really? I think I can climb up here. Oh shit, the bird, the bird, the bird! Oh god! Holy shit, I, was it really that simple? Was that really that simple? Seriously, that was all I had to do was... Oh my god, I spent... Oh, how long was I stuck on this part earlier? Oh shit, yeah! Get under the wall! Alright, so... This has got to be timed. If this isn't timed perfectly, we're going to be in big trouble. No, kid, you need to grab it. If I hit, if I push E, you need to grab the damn thing. There we go. Pull, pull, kid, pull! Okay. All right. I just saw the bird over there, actually. <laughs> Fuck you, bird. Alright, um... So we obviously need to make use of this, but... Oh, shit. Okay. Uh... Oh! Hello! Hello! Hello there. Oh, there indeed. Okay, never, we, we've got this! Shit, have we got this? Let's see, line it up. In the water, you bloody twat. Yeesh. This the shadow covers the sunlight. There we go. I'm guessing I have to. Oh, bloody hell. That do. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay, out of there. Out of there, kid. What has that accomplished exactly? Fucking bird. This game's gonna make me dislike birds. Yeah, go that way. I'm actually impressed that the water of all things actually protects us. It's like you, you wouldn't think it would, considering how relatively shallow it is. It, it is relatively shallow compared. Oh, there we go. Stairs. Off you, overgrown buzzard. Hold, kid. Hold all your might. Oh, my. That was close. Is it dead yet? Hit it again. Hit it again. Is it wrong that I want to murder the bird? Oh, okay. So I have to go over here. Alright, ups a daisy, up and over. I don't know if I want to jump in there. Okay, I'm going to avoid jumping in there so I can explore a little bit first. Then I'll jump in there. Speaking of exploring. Hello, Seagull. Oh, I'm humming to the gecko. <laughs> Well, that works. Those are some big jellyfish. Goodness. <laughs> Alright, well. Uh, I don't know if I want to go in there. I'm going to take the stairs down first. See where these stairs go first, and then we'll come back and... Uh... Huh, interesting. One of those keyhole things. The stairs just go down to here. 
down to the waterfront. And we drove up the stairs, we're not coming back. So rather than go somewhere where we know we can get to regularly, let us go somewhere we're not sure if we can get to regularly. Actually, speaking of, it's down here. Anything? No? I don't see anything. Okay. I cannot tell if, the, if those white markings are supposed to be bird shit, or if it's supposed to be like, you know, places where it's weather worn. Oh, okay, I see where we are now, I think. I hope. If I don't see where we are now, then, I'm, then this kid's in trouble. <laughs> Yep, okay. Exactly where I thought it was. Up to the surface of that. Wait, what was that? Oh, it's just a shadow. Okay. I thought I saw something moving over there. Like, oh, no. So there's one more of these windmill things to activate. You know, the sea level has, it, it has risen quite a lot here. I mean, not not since I've played, but just, I'm looking at, oh, hello. It's the goat. Hey, it was Foxy. There's Foxy. And all these ghost dudes are back. There goes Foxy. Hi there. You know, for being so terrifying, these things are awfully harmless. Uh, I'm not really afraid of them at this point, because they just go poof when you get near them. Boo! Boo! It's like the monsters from Monsters, Inc. They look terrifying when they're terrified of children. <laughs> They sound and look really frightening, but they don't do anything, so it's like, okay, well, I guess you don't really serve much of a purpose. <laughs> Here's where I was trying to get earlier, when, they, when the bird was still active. Pardon me, guys, coming through. Oh, some of these guys are actually running. Like, they're, they're, they're actively running. Did the kid? I really wonder if the kid did something. I, I, I'm starting to suspect who this kid might be in a way. I don't know if I'm it's accurate. Oh shit, what am I doing? What have I done? I really should have looked around first before doing this. But I think this is the only option I had anyways, so fuck it. Yeah, okay, so... Magic voice. <laughs> Fucking Michael Jackson right here. It's the rebirth. Yeah, I've actually been I've actually been warned by some of my uh, friends and watchers that this game is going to break my heart. Uh, we'll see. I haven't cried for very many games. Even games that are pretty they're supposed to be pretty sad. They haven't made me really cry that much. There's only a few handful of games. I can actually count them on my hand, literally, uh, that have made me cry. So we'll see if this one becomes one of them. Um, you know, I'm not going to say it won't. That'd be silly for me to say it won't when I don't know what's going to happen. But, you know, it, the, if you expect me to have an emotional reaction to something, the worst thing to do is to tell me I'm supposed to have that emotional reaction because then I'm sitting here looking at you incredulously like, okay, we'll see. So to everyone who said, okay, prepare to cry, well, we'll see. If, if I do cry during this game, then it will join a uh, brief list of games that have made me uh, cry. Oh boy. Bird brain's gonna be back. Glass towers there. This one's different than all the rest. Oh, okay.
Okay, our cover is not permanent in this area. That is not reassuring. Move, kid! Don't just stand there, Christ! I hear Foxy. I don't see Foxy, but I hear it, he. I don't know. I don't actually know if Foxy is a girl or a guy. For all I know, Foxes are hermaphrodites. The only reason I'm pretty certain that isn't the case is that most Foxes aren't hermaphroditic. Like most mammals aren't hermaphroditic. Fun fact about mammals, they typically only have two genders. And they've yet to be uh, tinkered with enough by us to be uh, able to do more than that. Fish on amphibians, on the other hand, they can have more than two genders. Specifically because they can swap genders back and forth rather conveniently. Oh, I'm not going to make it. There's no cover. There's no cover. No, kid, roll down the hole! You dumb little bastard! There's a hole right there. Oh my god. I shouldn't be abusing children like this, but... Oi, it's a game. It pisses me off. Okay, I hear Foxy a lot louder now. Oh, I see Foxy. Hey, Foxy. You know, it strikes me that if Red and Foxy have things they want me to do, which they apparently do, that it'd be a lot more productive instead of, you know, running around ahead of me and, like, hoping I can find them and follow them effectively. It'd be a lot more effective if they just hung out and, like, you know, showed me the way. You know, like Uganda Knuckles. Uganda Knuckles is a decent chap, you know. He he shows me the way. Fun fact, I said that, uh, you know, my roommate and I work at the same company together. I mean, we both work uh, you know, night shift, etc. At the same job. And, oh... Wait, where's the bird? Why isn't the bird attacking me? I'm not complaining, but where is the bird? Ha! Oh, shit. I had to ask that question. I had to ask that question. Oh my god. Ha! Hey, bird, follow the shouting kid. Um, the other day, you know, I, I just, I looked up, you know, uh, I don't know if everyone's seen the meme or not, I'm hoping that most people know what the meme is, but the, uh, the car salesman meme that was making the rounds this past week or so, a little more than a week now, I guess, because I know where to go now, uh, someone did a Uganda Knuckles uh, version of that, where the car salesman is Uganda Knuckles and slaps the hood of a Uganda Knuckles car and goes, this bad boy knows the way. And the bird knows the way as well. <laughs> okay, so uh, we may or may not be able to do that. But maybe if we go around this way... Yep, there we go. Oh. Jesus Christ, kid. Like, you, you, you charged right off a tower in an earlier gameplay, and now you're afraid to walk off of that. You rampaging twit. Oh, bloody... Pigeon. Frickin'. I, I hope that at the end of this, like, like the, the, these storm clouds we're gathering, just like turn this bird into like chicken wings or something. <laughs> For all the. There we go, Jesus. For all the um, trouble it's caused us. Mm, pardon me. That I condone violence against animals, but in this case, I think I, a nice roast bird would do. Cook it up. Oh, I can't. Okay, I can't do that. It looks like this. Oh shit! <laughs> good thing I moved. Very good thing I moved. Oh my god, bird! What have I done to you? Is that just like you know, threatened to move your shiny ball? Yeah, 
if this level ends in the death of this bird, I will not cry. I will not shed a single tear. I am going to. I am going to cheer. Has anyone ever heard of the comedian uh, Stephen Lynch, by chance? Uh, just, I'm curious, because uh, he's not a very well-known comedian, perhaps, but he's one of my favorites. And, uh... Oh, hello. Hello. I, did we just do that without trying? Seriously? This game bothers me so much, because like, there's times like that where it's like, I'm not even trying to complete the puzzle, I'm just experimenting to see, you know, maybe I can get this to work. And then that's things like that happens where it's like, oh, I, I just completed the puzzle without even... Motherfucker. It can't be that simple, there has to be something more. Oh! Hello, bird. Okay, that was <laughs> that was legitimately startling. <laughs> oh god. Uh, but no, um, back when I was saying about Stephen Lynch, if I can get back to that. Uh, yeah, he's a, a singing comedian. I don't know if he's still active or not. He was for a while. He was. He's a very amusing fellow. Um, okay, so is the bird? Okay, the bird is still there. So that means I've got to move these things in a way that adjusts them to the proper height. Huh, interesting. Because I can't... I don't want to... The bird's looking at me. That's obviously not it. So that closes... Alright, so those two there do that. I've got to do this in a way that opens... Is there a combination of these that's going to result in a different pattern, or they all do the same thing? See, either this is the most obnoxiously simple puzzle ever, or I am missing something, and given my intellectual capacity, it is quite possible that I'm missing something. Those of you who don't understand what I just said, I just called myself stupid. Okay, can I get past the bird, or is he, auto is he always going to attack me? I assume he's always going to attack me. Oh! Ah! Ha-ha! Ha-ha! There we go. Well, fuck you, bird. Ha! What has this accomplished? What the hell did that just accomplish, if anything? I wonder... If I turn this like that... That can't be it, can it? Also, where the hell is this light source coming from? It's there, and there. That can't be it, can it? Is that what they want me to do? 
I don't think the kid can make that jump, given his so far rather lackluster climbing performance. <laughs> there are times here where he just doesn't climb well. Alright, so I gotta roll past the bird so he doesn't throw me in the water again. There we go. Ha <laughs> Fuck you, bird. I'm turning the drumsticks. Maybe this is what they want me to do. Oh, fuck me. Okay. Not what I was thinking they wanted me to do, but that works. I legitimately did not think that was what they were going to want me to do. But this does solve the problem I was having. Voila. Shit. Birdo is back. God, I can't wait to get out of this area. Like that bird is making this area un unpalatable. Just is not pleasant. Oh dear. I actually played a game called Abzu lately. I think it was called Abzu. I, don't, I hope I'm pronouncing it correctly. Um, but it did, it, it's told the story in much the same, in a very similar way to the way this one does. You know, the, the, the characters don't speak. Oops. There's no real interaction between the characters and anything else, per se. What it is instead is everything is told through imagery that you find on the walls. It's a very fascinating way to tell the story, in my opinion. Ay, mother! Uh. I kind of like it. I like that. I enjoy that style of storytelling, you know, where it's you know, less about characters talking. Whoa! Hello, bird brain. Oh, that's going to be a problem, isn't he? He's going to start... The bird's going to be breaking through these, these holes, isn't he? No kid. There we go. Thank you. God. What? Oh, I see. The time I'd like the bird to break something, he's not available. Hmm. Yeah, the, 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 this style of storytelling is very pleasant. I think yeah, it's it's very fun uh, with the uh, you know, the character interactions kept to a minimum, and instead the thank you, bird. Pleasant for you, bird, if you just, you know, leave me alone. Like, honestly, if the bird would just leave me alone, this could be over with. But no. The bird has to be all hoity doity. It needs the golden ball for some reason. <laughs> Watch, we find out the ball is actually, it's like, it's a chick, it's the egg. That's why the bird's so pissed. Mm. Alright, I guess I'm supposed to jump it. Hello, bird. It obviously has some idea of where I am, so... I'm surprised it isn't attacking me. I think that should completely clear the skies of the Dovergrom Vulture. 
<laughs> Hit it a few more times, please. not very fan. Oh, there we go. Right there. Foxy. Hey, Foxy. said hello to. <laughs> what the, I wasn't even going that direction. What the hell, kid? Yeah, there, look, that's where the bird was. Right there, that nest is where it's... Is the bird up there still, I wonder? These ghosties are, are around the bird's nest. I really do wonder. I'm exploring real quick, people, and then we'll go continue on and uh, figure out what fate has fallen the bird. This is <laughs> okay. There's nothing here. All right, so let's go back up there. Take a look. Is that that foxy down there? Oh, that's one of the geckos. Okay. Before me, so <laughs> Oh, if you're a orc, Wag! hooray! I found another one. Obviously, I'm missing a lot. I'm gonna have to replay this game and try to find all the pieces of these things that I'm missing because <laughs> I'm missing so many things. <laughs> you might call me incompetent. I actually did this with my little brother once when I was uh, goofing around with him. I, I, I did like an orc, you know, wog right the call right in his face, just at full volume. I'm not gonna do it here because I'll wake my roommate up and my neighbors. But it was funny. It was really funny. <laughs> he, he, he looked like I had, like you know yelled his head off or yelled his hair off. It was pretty goofy. I don't know what brought that on. I can't remember what the conversation was that started that, but something something brought that up. That was amusing. Light all the torches, kid. Hmm. Alright, Foxy, lead the way through the creepy, crazy shades that may... I mean, these things are afraid of me, and they look terrifying, which makes me wonder what I must look like to them. Foxy, where are you going? Where are you taking me? Are we going beneath the bird's nest? 
I'm still wondering... The shadows are up there. I can see the shadows on the bird's nest. What is going on here? you little dick. Don't push me out. Well, I guess I shouldn't be too surprised by that. No, Foxy isn't exactly normal. We've, we woke Foxy up from a statue after all, so hey. This is Okami's, like, you know, cousin. <laughs> Instead of Okami, it's Foxy. Or, uh... I think it's Kitsune? Yeah, Kitsune is the uh, word for uh, foxes, I believe. Now what? Now what have I got myself? Oh, there we go. This is probably a longer video, I think. I, I, haven't I haven't actually been... Usually I keep track of the time, but I haven't actually kept track of the time in this one. I've actually just been playing, and I want to... Because uh, I'd like to just get this bird brain thing out of the way. I want to figure out what happens to the bird, or the gold ball, or what have you. Oh, no. Oh, God, kid, are you okay? So this will probably be uh, closer to, uh, this might be a bit longer, so I apologize for anyone who is watching this going, when the fuck is he going to end it? I, I promise you, I intend to end it relatively soon. Oh, the way these camera angles keep shifting, it's a pain in the ass. to do. Wrong button. That was that was my fault, everyone. I apologize. That's no one's fault but my own. I admit. Oh god, I gotta switch. I might have to switch the controls up at this rate. I keep pushing the stupid shift key to get up. And it's actually the space key that I want. Alright, so like, get your finger away from that button. There we go. And my finger is now away from that button. Hmm. Upsy daisy, lad. Relatively simple, I say, as I fall off this thing repeatedly. Down. Around we go. Jump. Jump. Traverse around. Jump. Upsy daisy. Uh, up Sedaisy again, I guess. Yep, there we go. Up under here. Up we go. Is the bird? Okay. I think the bird's dead. <laughs> I'm not sorry about the bird, honestly. I, I am not at all sorry about the bird. I'm sorry about you guys, though. I don't mean to... They're, they're chasing it. Right, the bird is taken care of. Oh no. The bird's not dead. The bird's angry. The bird's on fire. Stop, kid. Please don't stop. Just keep going. Oh no, 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 oh no. I think that's the end of the bird. Bird's dead. That's all I really care about. Bird is gone. Bird is no more. I I am happy to accept this predicament. Alright. Now the question is, how... How does this adjust? K. 
Canada to us properly. There we go. Okay. Foxy. Oh, the giant turkey is dead. That's all I care about. Piss off, you giant turkey. Aha! We've done it, folks. Now, I think this means we're going to go into a new area. Is this... Yep. Yes, it is. There's the Hades Whirlpool thing again. Is Red upstairs? I actually didn't look. I should have looked to see if Red was up there. Is that... I don't think I've seen Red this entire time. I actually don't think I've seen Red at all this whole time. Oddly enough. Hmm. Interesting. What a curious predicament. Uh, I don't know if Red's just not here, or... Wait, are we building on each level? Is that what's happening here? Is the original level all the way down there? Yeah, it is. All the way down there. The stairs are gone, but the original level is all the way down there. You can see it just over the edge there. Huh. Fascinating. Very fascinating. This one looks like it's going to be a lot more foresty. The more sand. Anakin can't freak out on us now. Into the woods, lad. Or through the woods. Whichever woods. Those woods, these woods, any woods. Oh god. We're in water. <laughs> it's damp. It's moist. Alright. What have we gotten ourselves up to? Let's see. Okay, we're back on the boat. Back on the boat, indeed. Um. Oh, am I supposed to move? Oh, I am. Oh, there we go. Aha! Oh my. Well, so much for being stuck on a salt flat. Now we're in the ocean. Hang on, kid. Get down from there, I think. Hey, it's red. Foulness is afoot. Alright. Well, I guess that would be the end of that, it would seem. And now we just go wait to the random spiral to finish up. And we'll be done for now until the next se sequence opens up. Thank you everyone for watching. It's been quite fun playing this game. I'm rather enjoying it. It's quite a charming game, really. Hmm, I do wonder. I begin to suspect certain things, but I don't know if they're actually going to be true or not. I don't want to spoil it for myself or anyone else watching. I was right, we are now in a forest. There we are. It's just as confused as, oh, as the rest of us. Okay, kid. Upsy daisy on your feet. Good lad. Prepare yourself. Here we are. Huzzah. There we go, everyone's awake. And we'll call it quits there, folks. Thank you, and see you next time.